All right, uh, this morning, running a little late, had some stuff I had to do this morning, but I'm meeting up with my, my, my sponsor, my buddy Greg, um, from Mondo's Fishing. We are gonna go fish a, a local boat tourney. So he's already out there. Um, I'm gonna run down and he's gonna pick me up at the boat ramp. Uh, it's on Cyprus, but I guess you can fish Cyprus, Hatch, Naha, and Kissimmee. We're gonna see how it goes. Wind's supposed to get a little bit brutal this afternoon. It's just a morning tourney, so it's short. You know, I think they started at first light, so they've already got an hour on me, or he's been out there about an hour by himself. But we're gonna give it a shot to see what happens. Uh, on his boat, when I'm fishing with him, and we're fishing these these derbies, I'm 2-0. and oh. Like, we've won, I've fished twice, we've won twice. Uh, so a win today, going into this weekend, would be just like, killer confidence booster considering uh, I'm not doing the KBF I decided against doing the KBF the amount of running around and 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 money that would be spent on that and and and, and travel is it's it's just a little bit too much for what I could possibly get out of it and I don't feel confident coming into uh, you know fishing the lakes that they have up right now and I didn't have time to take off this week so uh, with the week of the tournament so I'm not gonna fish that um, instead, I'm going to fish on the boat with Woody, and we're going to fish the uh, Strike King Big Bass Challenge. It's closer. We're going to fish on uh, on Toho. It just, for what we're putting into it, and the amount of travel, and what we could possibly get out of it, the reward is a lot better than fishing the KBF right now. Uh, that I've already paid for the Hobie, which I'm prepping for that. So, get down here and uh, see if we can't hook into something and, and win the Slocum Derby again for the third time in a row. Um, now let's see what happens. Yeah, you, you know, nope. that's not, yeah, that's not even the right species. I'm on fire today. Shit, I'm not supposed to catch. Take round number two. Oh, this one's a baby. I wonder where that looks back up. Like what, in the back up? No, just up closer to it. But. Happened right at the boat. Like nice. it, I didn't I'll take it. Oh, well, that's two, right? Yeah. I don't think I don't think the fish have pushed. I think the, the males right now are right on the edge. I don't think they're up up shallow. Greg's like, really good at catching these. Patrick. Is that three pickerel now? Three. Perfect. And a giant mudfish. Uh, dude, that's not good. My, uh, my reel came apart. Huh? Yep.
let's try this abomination with the left hand. I can't fish left handed. Huh? No, 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 I don't like it. I don't like false, fine, fine movements in my weak hand. Yeah. yeah, it is a gator. There we go, there we go. He's probably still there. He's probably just laying down. Four, I need one more. didn't get in his mouth, but I yoinked him. Pulled the worm out or no? Huh? Just pulled the worm out. The hook didn't come through. through this all right so cut a limit ended up with like five nine so we did clear five pounds thank goodness that would have been really embarrassing if we didn't well, especially on five fish uh not really the boost of confidence i was hoping for but this lake i don't know it's hit or miss for me here and uh you know greg said he doesn't really do well here either so but it's good just to get out get some get some practice on the boat because we've got the big bass tournament this weekend um hopefully you know woody and i can cash a couple checks on that greg won't be with us he'll be doing something else but uh yeah, so I think the winner had 22 pounds, which is a really good bag. They had two sevens. So that's a that's a pretty good bag for down here. But, you know, it is what it is. We fish in Toho for the big bass tournament. I think the entire chain is open, but Woody and I are going to focus on Toho because we feel confident there. So we'll see what happens uh, on Saturday. Until then, if you're looking for any new gear or anything, check out Greg's shop, mondosfishing.com. There's a 10% discount code in my uh, description. And he's got a lot of cool stuff, including the Arc. If you're, uh, you like the Arc rods, if you ever wanted to try them, they're pretty good. I'm pretty confident in those, in those types of rods. Very well built. So I have I have one uh, for pitching and flipping. And then uh, some of the hard baits and stuff are actually pretty good too, like the, uh, the lipless cranks. So check those things out. Otherwise, stay safe out there, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.